Hey, good morning, everybody. What's going on? Welcome, welcome, welcome to Mine O'Clock Music. Hope you're all doing well. I'm James. I'm here. We got some subs. We got somebody accusing me of being late. Running late again, James. I don't think you can blame Sergio. What are you talking about? I'm running late. I'm perfectly on time. I went online at like 10 o'clock. I think it ticked over to 10.01 the second I went online. I am never late. I am like a wizard. You know? Arrives exactly when he means to. Anyways. Uh, Polly Rebel, welcome back for 32 months. Uh, why is Lurbot being weird? I think it's Sundus. Sundus, 18 months. Here, take my toddler age subscription. It can walk now and knows basic words, but can't speak in full sentences yet. Mm, that's fair. Uh, Stumpinot, welcome back for 37 months. And Admiral Matt for 84. Thank you, friends. Uh, hey, everybody. What up? We're going to play some more Minecraft through the ages. 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 Let's bring our friends in. Ages. 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 There we go. Perfect. Worked well. Uh, good morning to both Surge and Rebellious Uno. Hey. Afternoon. Surge. Ages. Ages. All right. Works for me. Uh, hashtag not a cult. Yeah. Uh, today. Okay. Here's the deal. Um, last week, we were meant to move on to 1.6.4. And when all three of us tried to launch it last week, it just didn't work. So we're like, okay, we'll stick around in the 1.5 world because we still have things to do mainly we still hadn't even gotten a uh we hadn't killed the, the wither yet so that's what we did last week we just hung out in 1.5 um with the intention of moving just skipping past 1.6 today and moving on to 1.7 turns out uh 1.7 1.8 1.9 possibly further beyond that uh have some issues that I do believe we have, I found a solution for, um, but found it just a little bit too late. So, um, meanwhile, 1.6.4 just works now. Like, it just works. Just, just, who knows? I don't understand. It, it just, it just launches now. I don't even really know why I tried it this morning. I think just because 1.7 was being a, a butt, and I was like, okay, well, what is, does one point, I still had 1.6.4 installed from last week. And I don't even think I, like, consciously was like, oh, I should try 1.6.4 to see if it works now. I just kind of launched it. And then it just works now. So, cool. I guess we're going to go to 1.6.4 today, which is the horse update. Ooh, uh, the horses. And then next week, assuming that the solution, which, by the way, I think is just to launch Minecraft 1.7 in Forge, uh, which, sure... Um, then next week we'll move on to 1.7.10, which is a very big update and adds a bunch of new world generation. And I had already, like, I have the world trimmed down and uploaded, uh, cause again, I thought we were going to do that today. Um, so that's all ready to go. Uh, obviously I'll have to do that again because we're going to make some progress today. Um, but that's fine. It's an easy process that uh, doesn't actually take very long and is uh, very simple, in fact. Um, but yeah, so today we're going to hang out and we're going to move into the horse update, uh, which was released on July 1st, 2013. Uh, the other thing we're going to do today is uh, attempt to build an iron farm. Um, I don't know if we're actually going to go look for horses as well. I mean, we could, but I, I don't know if we have saddles. So we'll we'll get into the game and see the, what's going the on. Word, but... The word attempt is doing a lot of heavy lifting. Yeah, in exactly. That, in that sentence. Yeah. So uh, let's take a look real quick here. Uh, additions. The hay bale is now in the game. I exciting. Uh, carpets are now in the game. That's actually kind of cool. Um, crafted with two wool. Makes sense. Um, so that's neat. That's neat. Hardened clay uh, is now in the game. Uh, cool. Uh, as is stained clay. 
um, which can be come in 16 what colors. An awful name. Yeah. For a block. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, so this is clay. similar to wool in the sense that it can be dyed of the 16 colors of dye. So uh, easy, easy, easy. Block of coal is now in the game. Uh, that's that's neat. Crafted only with coal, not charcoal. Uh, can be used as furnace fuel and smells eight items. 80 items, sorry. Uh, more than nine coal. <laughs> I like that it says more than nine coal. Uh, <laughs> items. We have horse armor. Uh, we have a horse spawn egg, which won't really come into play because obviously spawn eggs are uh, not in uh, survival. Uh, leads are now in the game as our name tags. That's kind of exciting. We can name things now. Hooray. But not each other. Yeah, no. Um, we have horses because that's what we just said. Uh, this is interesting. Creation assisted and inspired by Dr. Zark's Mo Creatures mod. Uh, that's kind of neat. Uh, to tame, ride them, and get thrown off. Uh, to tame, ride them, and get thrown off a few times until hearts appear. Can be bred using golden apples and golden carrots. Drops leather when killed. Health can be restored using bread, sugar, hay, wheat, apples, golden apples, and golden carrots. Baby horses can be grown the same way. Players riding saddled horses are granted full control over the horse's movement. Color, style, maximum health, jump height, and speed vary between horses. Open your inventory, right-click a horse, or press the inventory key while sneaking and looking at a horse to access their inventory to deal with their storage, armor, and saddle. And they rarely spawn in small groups. N neat. Uh, donkeys are in the game now. They're like horses, but smaller and gray. That's exactly what real life is like um mules they can be obtained by breeding a horse with a donkey they can wear chest uh wear chests on their saddles just like donkeys not breedable with horses donkeys or other mules and then there are skeleton and zombie horses introduced as the code of the normal horse although requires 30 party modifications to be used so they don't exist yet I don't think I've ever seen a zombie horse. I don't think I have. I don't. Well, I don't think they're in the game anymore. Yeah. Uh, right. Skeleton horses are obviously still in the game. Uh, I don't want to talk about it. Status effects. You, you can still summon zombie horses, apparently. Oh, neat. Cool. Uh, status effects: health boost. Uh, looks like it's in the game, as is absorption now. Uh, saturation. Causes food meter to be plenished by one food per tick. Can be acquired by the command blah, blah, blah. That's whatever. Uh, what else we got here? General resource pack systems. Uh, what else we got here? Changes. Lapis lazuli block retextured subtly. Uh, redstone comparators now give out a signal for cauldrons and end portal frames, depending on their state. Uh, command blocks can no longer be mined or destroyed in survival. Lava now decays properly. That's interesting. Finally. Um, items. Charcoal is retextured. Saddles. The saddle. The player can now put a saddle on a horse. Um, golden apples now require gold ingots instead of gold nuggets to craft. Golden apples now give regeneration 2 for 10 seconds, and both tiers give absorption for 1 minute 30 seconds. Uh, glistening glistening wa melons now require eight gold nuggets. Uh, Flint and steel now loses durability when igniting TNT. Uh, mobs named Dinnerbone or Grum are now flipped upside down. That's exciting. Um, spiders now have a chance to spawn with potion effects. World Generation Deserts no longer contain water lakes, and they've added chest generation in nether fortresses. Wasn't that already there? Wait, there were no chests before then? No. Oh, there weren't. I know that there weren't when we first did it, and I thought that was just because we hadn't regenerated them, but apparently this is the update that actually made chests. That's so funny. Yeah. I mean, to be fair, they're usually filled with horse armor, so it makes sense. Yeah. That's very funny. Um, um, I I like the fact that we had saddles prior to this and not horses. And not and we horses, didn't yeah. That at all. Well, you know, could, um, we could pigs. ride pigs. You could ride pigs, yeah. That's sure, but like, 
why why was that yeah <laughs> you know what i mean, I mean yeah why oh yeah they absolutely saddles if they didn't have horses you know yep no i agree 100 percent uh all right there isn't a whole lot more here that's uh super interesting we're going to be playing in 1.6.4 um again i think those are just um now remembers who's oh does, uh, horses now remember who tamed them that's exciting 1.6.4. Yeah, these are all just fixes, so nothing exciting there. So, yeah. All right. Let's hop in and see how this is going. Uh, T and Troll. Welcome back for 34 months, by the way. Ellen Jewel, welcome back for 101. Dang. Uh, I Mr. think the other, the other interesting one. Sorry. No. Nope. Resource packs in this. Yeah. The resource pack changed, replacing the texture pack system. Oh, okay. That's that's actually big. I Which, mean... yeah, for for mob ma uh, for pack makers and stuff was was interesting. So textures, sounds, fonts, hmm. things like that could change. Uh, I am sleeping, by the way, because it is sleepy time. Uh, Mr. Nibbles, welcome back for eighty-three months. Fun fact: eighty-three is the sum of both three consecutive primes and five consecutive primes. Neat. Mantifold, welcome back for 52 months. Cyber Egg, welcome back for 75 months. And Pogo162 for eight. Welcome back, friends. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Uh, okay, so... It's really funny looking at this world, by the way, in the uh, map editor and deleting chunks because our home chunk is now basically just it stands alone in the snowy biome. <laughs> oh yeah, I haven't. I haven't imagined that it's going to be just so messy by the time. You know what I mean? Oh, it's going to be ridiculous next week. Yeah, because we're part jungle, part snow. Oh, that jungle's uh, going away. Swamp, I think. Rather, yeah. You know. Yeah, it's uh, <laughs> it's a little bit of a mess. All right. So theoretically, do we have any? So okay. So the big things today are obviously we can now find horses. So that's exciting. Uh, and then we were also going to try to build a. Uh, iron farm uh, because we fought the wither last week we built a beacon I'm actually I don't know where that beacon is I'm sure it's somewhere safe don't worry about it's it it's in the diamond chest um, but we don't have anywhere near enough uh, iron in fact we have very little iron we have some iron but it's not a lot so the thought was we could build an iron farm, uh, which is actually, uh, I I still really like the old school iron farm designs, um, and I think that's how this works. It's sort of the old big box, lot of doors, villagers. It's a variation of it. So I, I need I need to come clean. When I was trying to Google um, tutorials for 1.6 iron farms, it assumed. It assumed I just didn't know how to spell 116. <laughs> yeah, we have exactly one <laughs> tutorial. <laughs> yeah, we have one tutorial that we can follow, and I guess hope it works. Oh, this yeah. is a fun fight. You got this, Uno. I believe in you. Um, so I guess I mean that was ominous. Yeah. Um, did you hear that too? No. It sounded like there was like a jet plane that flew over. <laughs> <laughs> in real life or in Minecraft? No, in Minecraft. <laughs> was it was it not just the that creeper? No. What do you Oh, you're throwing eggs. Um May okay. I, um make a brief suggestion before we jump into stuff too? Yep. We are very diamond poor. Uh can we do a little bit of mining in the morning? Sure. Cuz we got we got like very few resources. What do I got here? Efficiency, right. This thing is very quickly dying. Uh, all right, let's uh, let's go into the mines. To the mines. All right, well, I'm gonna grab some torches and stuff first, but yeah. <laughs> we are diamond poor men, bedecked in diamonds. He says, "Yeah." Uh, all right, sure. Let's yeah, I can't find any more diamonds to wear. It's the worst. Yeah, exactly. Look, without mending, we um we need to have a steady source of income of diamond income to sustain the standards that I've become used to. Yeah, okay. no, that's 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 fair. That's fair. All right. 
into the mines. Um, so I guess, so the big thing is going to be we need villagers, right? Yeah. Um, and villagers means we're going to need rails, which is going to cost us lots of iron and potentially some gold as well. Can you do boats in villagers yet? Is that an option? Probably, but... Um, boats on only... land is probably worse yeah, than it's... boats in the water. It's way harder, you know? All right, so what have we done with the branch mines here? Plus, it'd be good. Uh, we, I know we wanted to also get the uh, rails going up here as well at some point. Actually, I'm going to go... Yeah. I mean, obviously, that would be... It, it would be fun, but... Boats control were updated this update. Oh. Do we even know where there's a village? Uh, not anymore, because uh, I think the desert got replaced. But, you know, maybe it's still in that desert. Yeah, that village may or may not be there, I guess. I miss having an offhand. Yep. I was that's, literally just going to say that. Was just going to say the same thing. The vein mines down here have become a, a, an unmanageable mess. Well, in my defense, I was really hoping that they would just get deleted today. <laughs> in, in my defense, I was left unsupervised. Hmm. Can't can't argue with that logic. I cannot find under these conditions. Where am I supposed to go? Just pick a direction and no. That's the problem, Uno. <laughs> you have identified the problem. Look, I cannot. I cannot clean. I cannot cook in a dirty kitchen. I cannot mine in a disorderly mine. Ah. That's what. That's that the thinking that got us into this problem in the first place. You know. I mean, they're, why are they're... there perpendicular lines? <laughs> <laughs> they're they're all going either north, south, or east, west. That's None the problem. Are... They should not go in two directions. <laughs> None of them are going diagonal. You know, just think about it. It could be worse. It could be worse. Mama Tats, welcome back for 37 months. Thank you. There you go. Uh -oh. You know Lobot's got it. All right, so here's what we're going to do. Here's what we're going to do. After we reset, we're going to pick one direction, and that will be the way we vein mine from then on. We expand the tunnel with access to the vein mines, and then we only vein mine in the one direction. And that way, that's another way so you don't get lost in the mines. Raven, 104 months, or 105 months. That's a lot. How's it going? Welcome back. The silence of agreement there was deafening. I really don't feel like there are as many diamonds in Minecraft as there are these days. Like, I, I just, I don't know where they all are. I don't understand. I feel like I've found very few diamonds. Does, does anybody else feel like this, or no? Yeah. It is very diamond... Uh, diamond light. That is a large slime. Hey, a slime chunk. Don't worry, it won't be there next week. Slimes are in this version. 
uh, like underground and stuff. Well, I guess we found one in the um, in the um, the swamp prior to this, eh? Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. Slimes have been around for a while. In older versions, I recall just using stone picks for mining, as that was the efficient for resources gathered. That sounds miserable. We get a lot more iron these days as well, you know. Especially, especially now iron's fortunable. Yeah. That was a good change. But there's still no key for sprint yet, so you still got to double tap. We're getting there, though. What update was that? Uh, I think it was like 1.8 or 1.9, people were saying last week. Oh, hey. Hello, Diamond. Remember that Surge has... Uh... Yep, I'm just going to dig it out. Today is a coffee and stroop waffle day. Damn. Ooh, stroop waffles. I want a stroop waffle now. It's only a single diamond. Okay. Can you turn down mob sounds yet? Nope. Nope. You have music and volume. Those are your two sound settings. I don't want to brag, but I'm bringing home six diamonds. Hello, gamers. If you didn't want to brag, why did you? That's fair. I want to brag. I'm bringing home uh, six diamonds, gamers. <laughs> that's that's better. Thank you. Thank you. Good feed. Good feedback. I'll uh, I'll incorporate that next time. We don't really care about redstone right now, do we? I don't think so. I mean, we have enough that if we wanted to do something redstone, we have it at home. Hmm. I've been grabbing it just because that's my usual instinct. We'll probably get on lapis as well, right? Yeah. I don't think lapis is even used for anything yet, right? It's still not. It's still not used for enchanting. Still not yet. even for enchanting. Wow. Yeah. Well. It's basically used for being blue. Yep. Yeah, I found zero diamonds. I've uh, I've got that one, uh, which at some point Surge can come down and hoover up. Hmm. Roger. Roger. Found some iron at least. That's nice. I mean, every, yeah, we need everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some resource for. So, great job. I'm gonna move iron off my hot box. I keep wanting to build with it. Sorry, what? Um, I'm bridging across some lava. Mmm. I keep scrolling to the next block, and it's iron ore. And I'm like, no, no, don't, don't put that down. <laughs> Right 
Right now there's three blocks. I don't really know why, but it's fine. Three blocks is, I think, the arguably correct distance to leave on vein mining because of diamond generation. Yeah, because, like, the chances <clears throat> of there being diamonds in this but not also visible here and here are very low. And if there yeah, is just... Tip. If it if that does happen, it means it's probably just one diamond, which means yeah, probably not worth your time. It's exactly. like it's not a huge deal. I'm also I'm of the opinion though as well. I've already found a single diamond, and we are quite diamond poor. Unless yeah, I mean again, there's always obviously you know, it's it's the average averages right? Like is it? Mm. What you is want to the maximize most of your it, diamonds yeah. per minute? Not yeah. Necessarily your mine, your diamonds per space. Yeah, exactly. Because for us, the most important resource we have is our time. Word Nerdify, welcome back for 23 months. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. As having spent probably 2,500 hours or more at this at this update, I feel pretty good about the uh, the Y level and uh, diamond spacing distribution of this particular vein mining strategy. You know, mm -hmm. served me all right. Yeah, you see, at this point, I'm I'm just throwing away with like three by three hammers. So yeah. <clears throat> I always leave two block gap because I like to use up less space with my mines. Yeah, that's totally fair. Yeah, beautiful thing about Minecraft. Go wrong, beat up the play. Alright, how long, uh, when are we capping this mining session? Uh, when my uh, diamond pickaxe runs out of durability. <laughs> Mm. Which is oh man, soon. I actually do love that early game challenge of like, all right, I've invested three diamonds in this pick. How many do I get back? Yeah. You know? <laughs> Come on, at least three. Come on, break even. <laughs> wow, that's a lot of lava I can hear. Holy moly! Like, that's so loud. There's so much of it. Ah! Hey, look at that. I found it. Is it now finding you? Uh, it, it definitely tried. <gasps> Diamond! Fair, 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 fair. This is right, self-touch, right? I come to where you two are? No, and, I have self-touch. Um, you? Okay. Yeah, five, six diamond ore. Let's freaking go. Mm. Nice. It's all worth it. Oh, don't have much durability left on this iron pick. Everything's coming up James House. Damn right. So now the chances of more diamonds being down, this thing is basically zero, but you know. Oh well. Ah. Okay. No thank you. More than doubled my pick investment. Well, hopefully, because we do have the, uh... Oh, this is where we felt the wither. I was like, what the hell's happening here? Did we seriously kill the wither in just this amount of space? That's like nothing. The wither is not difficult when you fromage it like we did. 
I feel like it it's harder now, or not harder, but at least has more health nowadays, though. Like, this is such a short little room. Like, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Like, it's like a dozen blocks long. Hmm. I, I, I know my pick is getting low. I don't particularly care. There's not really much I can do with it. We don't have mending. Yeah, yeah. there's no Welcome mending. Welcome to no more forever tools. Yeah, there's no mending, and repairing is prohibitively expensive, so I'm just going until this thing breaks. You can combine, but there's no point. You lose the enchantment. I should um, should start heading back now. Right. So if you see the two torches, I, uh, I'm sorry. I'm like 600 blocks down a branch mine. I'll get back to the start and then guide me to you. At this point, I uh, I'll just go in, in one ear, not the other. I'm just like too far. Fair enough. Oh, there goes my shovel. <clears throat> I have a good feeling there are diamonds through this dirt. I can hear it. Just right here. I can hear them calling. There's oh damn it. Where are they? I can hear them. They're in here somewhere. Damn it. I'm calling to you. Do I? Three in here. One, two, three. Damn. All right. Thought I just saw you beside me, Uno. Yeah, I went back up briefly. <laughs> All right, so I'm at the base. What are your yeah. instructions here? So if you oh, come hi. this way. I can just follow you. So it should be down this one. Uh, why is there a baby zombie on the stairs? Ow! What the? That was so weird. Yeah. One. I could have <laughs> got that. All that work. <laughs> In other news, I, I managed to stop my iron pick at zero durability. Ooh. Somebody has blocked off the door with diamonds. Damn right. I turned your six diamonds into nine. Fifty percent increase. I mean, hey, that's not bad. That's that's fine. So between the diamonds that all of us found, we are bringing home sixteen diamonds. That's uh, <laughs> it's not even a full suit that's, of armor. That's so bad. <laughs> oh no. Like that wasn't like a long. That was like maybe fifteen minutes of mining, but that's forty-five minutes of mining. Total, and we got 16 diamonds between be, between what? 13 ore? Yeah, it was pretty pants. Okay. Well, now that we have made very little progress, <laughs> um... I mean, everything's a little bit of progress. We invested, you know, we got a bit of an ROI. That's true. 
Uh, all right. Shall we go and peek the desert to see if that village is still there? Yeah, a little bit of scouting before we think of our next steps is an excellent, excellent suggestion. Because if it is there, great. And if it's not, then maybe uh, one of us can go out and look for a new one. And the other people can, can start work on actually, like, constructing the iron farm. Uh, yeah. Hopefully, hopefully we don't have to transport villages too far. I mean, yeah. Well, we always have the nether, which is, like, actually a legitimate option, you know? Is this desert it is even too far? You just make a portal on both sides and make is a little it... uh, little roller coaster for them, a little hell roller coaster. Why not build a farm where the villagers are? Because then it wouldn't be in our. Then base. we have to walk there for iron, and it will never be loaded. Yeah, no, it needs to be in our base. Also, I, I like I want it there. Like, sure, in in a in a world where like, uh, it would be just significantly easier that I I don't okay I don't think this desert is even here anymore it was um out the back of the base wasn't yep. it? yeah so we go to and, the starter and, house and then and, we walk straight back from it yeah like past yeah, the that's what I farm. Thought. yeah there's uh there's no village there's no desert here anymore maybe there's a village there still uh, another important consideration for this oh. world in particular is because we keep repeatedly deleting chunks and regenerating the world when they change world generation, we do want to try and keep as small a footprint as possible to make that process easier, right? Uh, I mean, y yes. It's it's really quite simple to... Like, in, it keeps the world file smaller, which is nice. Like, I downloaded it last night to do... Oh, I got the village. Um, hey, it is still here. Amazing. It's not been regenerated, has it? Because, well, I don't think this is the same village. I've got a village. Yeah, this is not a desert village. Yeah, this is all very different. Oh, out here is different. Yeah, this desert is still here. Yeah, th there's like the cobble leading into it. Yeah, but that's not the same desert. But it's still got the cobble in it. Yeah, that's because we went back out after the reset. We oh, went right, and, since and that looked reset. for the portal, remember? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, I mean there are villagers. So, so did you just go in a straight line past the um through the village based on where we So we oh, are yeah. oh, oh, it's right there. Oh it's okay. to the right. Uh okay. Villager trades gravel and an emerald for so for, for flint, I guess. I mean, the easiest first thing to do is just see if boats will work at all. Uh, do we have access to pistons in this version? Piston yes. and lever. Yeah. So I don't hate the railroad idea. My specific reason for that is we know we want to put a bunch of rails into our mine shaft after we wipe the world. You know. Mm-hmm. Ooh, wool for emeralds. You're not the worst. So what's our um what's uh, our goal here? Yeah, I don't I don't think boats work. <laughs> I think we uh, can oh can even two people go in a boat at did, the minute? Did you pick up that boat? Oh yeah, you did, okay. Yeah. Can you get in? Do we want to try and make a really long no. railroad? Or oh, do you we can't. Want to just take them through the nether. Yeah, okay. Boats don't work. So boats are definitely not an option. Um, okay. I don't know if we want to do the nether or. I mean, I guess the easiest way to figure out if we want to do the nether is to just build a portal and then see what that route looks like. I think we're close enough to the other portal that if we wanted to do this, we'd have to go through and just link them, which is not the biggest deal. But if we want to do it properly, we could actually just set the Y level, make portals on both sides, right? Yeah. And that way we can we can set the uh, the Y level as well at that time. I mean, I assume that minecarts. Well, I get like if we want to do the minecart thing, I assume it works, but I don't even know because 
Like, I don't even know how the nether would work because we don't have boats, right? What? You, just uh, you can send work. a minecart through into the nether. Oh, sorry. You, yeah, you would, just would... Push, push them through, catch them, put them in a minecart, drive them across. Yeah. Uh, I, I don't know. Which one do you think is easier? Do we want to do the overworld cart or do we want to do nether? I, I don't, don't think believe we're... we have the resources for the overworld. Uh, unless we sort of make some track, then push them, and then gra delete the track on the way behind them. You know, do it in a, a relay. Uh, the other thing we have to deal with is hills and trees if we do go in the overworld. Mm -hmm. uh, one vote for nether. All right, let's try the nether. Well, no, I, I, this one vote. This is a democracy. What, what, I, what I, I, I don't, do? I don't personally have a preference, which is. Yeah, I, I mean, if, if you're keen to try the Nether, then I'm just down to to try it. I just think it'll be um, less work. I, it's it's going to be one eighth the amount of work. Uh, yeah, I, yeah. I mean, whatever. I'm happy to Nether. Uh, I think it will introduce its own comical challenges. Will they go in a minecart? I mean, I assume so. I think they just they don't go in boats. Should. Okay, I'm heading back to the base to grab stuff we're going to need for this. Which I guess is... Obsidian. We need obsidian. We need rails. We need mine carts. Uh, so I get a little, uh, little dark. Yep. I mean, are there beds there? Didn't see any. Neat. <laughs> it's all right. I've I've got some mobile beds. Um, I just need to uh, convert Catch them. them. <laughs> I mean, I'm I'm back at the base. If you want to, if you two just want to log off real quick, and I'll sleep. I'm like um, literally right behind you, James. Oh, yeah. You, I'm, okay. I'm, like. Two minutes from crafting a bed. Uh, I just had to um, uh, extract some wool. Sleeping. There we go. I am, I am sleeping. There we go. There we go. Okay, so. Do we have 20 obsidian? First question. Um, we have five Currently, here. Currently, looks like we have... Wait, oh, did you just grab some? How I much was there? Five. All right, I'm going to go get us 15 obsidian from the mine. What's your pickaxe? Uh, I have an efficiency for diving okay. pick. Okay. Um, all right. So you can get us some obsidian. We need rails. How many rails do you think we're going to need here? Well, hold on. If we're here and Uno's there, we can actually do the math and divide it by eight. And that'll give us an idea of how many rails we need. Well, if I tell you my... I'm at 200 minus 666. Nice. 200 minus 666. So yep. our base is basically 0 minus 220. Uh, so can anyone do the Euclidean geometry on that? It's before 11. It's in my rider. <laughs> I don't do math. Um, I guess where do we want to bring them out and try to... I guess we maybe want to put this over... I don't know where we want to actually put this thing. Maybe like up here, I guess. Up by the TNT. Let's say we put it right here-ish. So that's 80 minus 253. Oh, we, we should probably just use our existing portal. So, like, let's do let's do the math from where our portal is right now. Because uh, otherwise, we actually need 
significantly more obsidian, which is kind of a pain to get. Forty minus one ninety three. What did you say your coordinates were? Two hundred minus six six six. So two hundred that way. It's like right over there. So it's like four hundred blocks ish. Ah, uh, there we go. All right. Two hundred and zero. <clears throat> This is minus six 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 and twenty uh eight hundred and ninety three blocks uh away from zero minus two twenty. God so, I'm glad we're not doing that in the overworld that's so long. So we need nine nine hundred blocks. Call it hundred and twenty five rails. Yeah, through the nether hundred and hundred and twenty five. If you've got two stacks, it's probably yeah, good enough. Yeah, I was just gonna say we can we can just go with two stacks to start and see how that goes. And then we need we could either push them or we need one powered rail for what every ten or something like that. Yeah, we. I mean, giving them a shove is easy enough. Uh, uh, we can get some powered rails. I mean, we have it, so we might as well. We'll need them for the mine. Um, the mine shaft later anyways. Yeah. All right. So we need that. We need that. I need wood. All right. How do we make rails? All right, James, I'm going to give you, it's 10 obsidian, right? Um, yeah. Wait. I'm going to give you We need enough five for... more? I have five on me. Let's just double check the math. That's what you actually need for a portal. Yes, just... that's 10. I have 10. Perfect. All right. Uh, I'm going to grab a flint and steel. I think we have some in a chest already. How do you make mine cart track? Is it this? It's um. It's uh. It's that. Yeah, it's in the it's, middle. Yeah. It's like a ladder. Yeah. I got yeah, it. Yeah, I yeah. got it. All right, I'm gonna make a flint and steel, and I'm gonna start heading over to the nether and prepping stuff. And then uh, you're gonna to need to make your own flint and steel to bring with you. Okay, there's that, and then... I just tried to use the coal for flint and steel. How right, do you do well, powered rails? Uh, it's the same shape, but with gold in the middle and a, and a redstone dust underneath it. Yeah. How do you craft a flint and steel? It's a piece of flint and a piece of um, iron. Yeah, but what orientation? Because the crafting bench is not giving me the recipe. Uh, diagonal. Yeah. It, which diagonal? Iron in the middle, flint oh in the bottom. Oh my god, no. It's iron in the top left, flint in the bottom right. I went through every permutation. A any <laughs> there, So there's any way where iron is diagonally atop the flint will yeah, work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The iron has to be up and to the left. Yes. That's the, that's yeah. the problem I had. Yeah. yeah. Flint top iron bottom is wrong. <laughs> yeah, yeah. See, I tried that. Yeah, it has to be iron top left, flint bottom. Oh, that's interesting. All right. Uno. Yeah. Uh, can you find a location uh, on your side and give me the exact coordinates and I'm going to go through and start making a portal on my side and then we'll so, um in in chat 200 minus 666 and in is, the is that where you want the is that where you want the portal yeah that'll be that'll be close enough to the village okay that's I wasn't sure if that was an approximate location of where you want no no, no not close enough let's put it literally right in the village I want to move them I as it as right in the village yeah 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 Find the highest density of villagers, put them in a box, and then put the nether portal right beside it, and then tell me where that is. Give me a second, let me head back. Where am I going? Uh, you're going to the village with the obsidian and the flint and steel. Okay, that's what I thought. How 
how, what we're reckoning, this track oh. leads us oh. through gas territory. Everything's gas territory. <laughs> Are we going to just do one at a time? Do we want more than one minecart? Uh... Might That's as well grab us. a couple. Sorry? Might as well grab a couple for when it goes horribly wrong. I just don't want to spend too much of our iron here. I'll make three. It's like... Four villagers stuck in this house. Perfect. I think you're also... Um overestimating how far a hundred blocks is, you know? Like, they're not they're not going very far at all, right? No, no. Okay. Heading back. Um... Can you breed villagers here? Uh, it requires doors. It's a bit weird. Um, I'm in the nether. Can you do that math for me, Una? Yeah, I'm just doing it now. Awesome, thank you. Uh, or I was doing, but then there were zombies. Uh, so it's still 25. Okay. And, uh, what did I say? Minus 650. Yeah, uh, 81. 25, 81. A uh, negative 81 or positive? Uh, negative 81. Thank you. Yo, you sheep see any horses lately? Hey. Horse? Okay. Where am I putting this portal? You're going to be amazed at just how easy this is on the nether side. You're going to look at this and you're going to be like, oh. I'm thinking right, the portal uh, on this uh, should appear. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. stuck in here now or in here aha sick that's a lot of uh yeah yeah four four of them trapped in this house have you have you looked outside oh it's it's nighttime now that's not great well i brought a bed I guess james log out i'm out okay Stay again. Yeah, let me know when you have a portal on your side. Just about to build it. Haha. Uh, all right, so it's just going right here? Yeah, I think right here. This should be good. I've, I've never used a door as corners before, so... Alright, can I light this portal? Yeah, don't go through it yet. It is lit. I was just making a track for us here. Hella lit. Yo, this portal's so lit. 
Alright. And you should see me right now. Ooh, good start. And now, if we go back through... Um, I, I didn't see you. Well, I saw you too. Alright, this is working for me. Come on through. Yo. Yeah, I can't see you when you come through the portal either, which is very funny. Yeah. Oh, but you see me this time. Huh? Oh, I see both oh, of you. Oh, that's so funny. Um, I see your hitboxes as being, uh, like, submerged under the ground, which is very funny to me. I thought you said this was easy. <laughs> <It's chaos here. laughs> I mean, look at the distance, though, you know? We just yeah. gotta get rid of this one ghast. Oh, hello. Ow, ow, I'm on fire. Ooh. Got it. Yeah, uh, look at how far we have to go. Yeah. That's it, you know? Alright. I'll start putting down the rail. <clears throat> Alright. Do you want to let's uh, start herding some villagers into minecarts then? Here, do you want to pass me some stuff? Oh, uh, we're going to need more redstone than just that. But do you have wood I, on you? Let's turn that I, into torches. I, well, I have six powered rails, which I feel like should be enough to get us there, right? Uh, I think um, you need one for about every eight to ten blocks. Yeah. If you don't have redstone, um, leave us. Just sticks and cobble. Well, I'll need to build. No, we more. have we have red. James made redstone blocks. We don't have enough powered rails. I mean, that's fine. It's it's pretty close. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. Why did I? Oh yeah. I did. Do you want me to just try? Um, have you got some um, minecarts and we can get them in on this side? James got all the stuff. We'll just, we'll just wait for him. It's Burr. Fine. Nudge. So there's a very real chance that we'll have to get them out of the minecart to push them through the portal. So we might just want to nudge them through the portal and then get them into the minecart on this side. Mm -hmm. uh, and similarly on the other side as well. Uh, so I'm just going to make little boxes for the transfer process. Yeah, I mean, I, we can shepherd them through as well. If we do this. <laughs> I don't see you. <laughs> These blocks are just going up and I don't actually see you. So weird. Uh, make sure you block off the opposite side of the portal too, so they don't just run through before they teleport. Yeah, he's doing that. Am I doing that? Or is a ghost just doing it? <laughs> I mean, can I right, try... Let's test the minecart first. I like this. Can I try pushing this guy through? Yeah. yeah give him a, I'm, give him wait, a I'm ready for them on the opposite side. No, he needs to come out. Hey, all right. There is a minecart and a villager who has come through. Okay. Nope. Uh, let's do this one at a time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on. Uh, so we'll also need somebody on the opposite side. We're going to need uh, extra minecarts because we're probably going to want to leave them in minecarts on the opposite side once they get there. You know what I mean? Sure. All right. All right. We ready to escort this one home? Yeah. Send them my way. I'm, I'm down Yeah. Here. So we'll get you at the other portal and then... Oh, crap. 
Oh no. What happened? Oh no. Uh, here, James, I need, can you give all of us a couple of mine uh, rails? Because I need rails to reposition them. Thank you. I, I think two have just decided to walk through the portal of their own accord. They have. Yep. Perfect. <clears throat> there we go. All right. I've got one in, James. Oh, God, there's a gas. Here it comes. Uh, you, why do people like corners so much? Okay, we're good. We're good. It's here. All right, so um, I need more minecarts, please. What do we want to do on the other side here, though? Oh, I was going to... Sorry, uh, when you say they got here, um, you should escort... Here, I'll help you out. Uh, I'll get on the other side to catch them. What we want to do is we want to break the minecart. So yeah. We, we kind of want it, want it like that. Break the minecart, push them through, and I'll be on the other side, and then we'll just let them chill on a minecart. Wait, we have to make sure it's never nighttime, though. All right. Uh, so please let them through. All right. How many of these do we want? Three. Uh, Socks Fox sixty nine, welcome back for fifteen months, and Ninja Puff, welcome back for thirteen. Appreciate it, friends. Thank you. Do uh, villagers get attacked by like zombies and stuff in this version? I don't even know. I don't know. I mean, I probably safe to just so. put them in a box. I yeah, I have. All right, so that's one. All right, so we have one on the other side already. Uh, we just need a fresh minecart for them. Did you have one? Uh, bring a couple. I gave you a minecart. Oh, cart. I've got one from James. Thank you. All right, so James, and I'll I've got, send you the next one. Yeah, I've got one more minecart. So if we only need three, then we're in a good spot here. I've got I've got three through the portal. So. Oh my God, you have. All right. Um. Sorry, I I need to jump around. That is too low. All right. Yes. Oh, goodbye. All right. Uh, James, incoming. Okay. Actually, Uno, do you want to go through the portal on the opposite side and then... Wait, no, we need one more minecart. I'm just, just going to say we have three locations and I'm kind of running back and forth between them both. Um... I just need. Do you have another minecart on you, Uno? I don't have any minecarts. I never. Okay, have. so James. James is the is the minecart holder. If you if you send a minecart, like well, no, just we need to leave, We need to leave them. Oh yeah. Yeah, we need to leave the mine. We need to leave them in the minecart so they don't wander away. All right. Wait, are these these guys are gonna be okay here for now, right? I'm, I'll put them in a box. If you wanna, if you wanna get Uno a minecart, I'll put them in a box. Uno, there you go. There's a minecart in there for you. Oh, All right. You, I thought you were inside. <laughs> No! <laughs> well, you're gonna die. How did they get out? He got out while I was trying to get back in. I just need a few rails. Yes! Yes! No! <laughs> and he's off. Uh, it is almost night time, stay in the nether and I'll sleep. So please don't come through. Alright, I've managed to finally get this third one. 
Oh, the one that was just sent was the third one. Oh, is it? Yeah, well, we, yeah, we this are. Extra as one. the next one that comes through the portal, we are done. Uh. All right, can you send him through? James? Yeah. All right, and then um, flying curtain. Heck yeah. Wait, what? How did you not get in there? God, these are all these slabs. Uh, yes. Huh. Why is he not getting a goddamn... There we go. There we go. Okay. Like I said, that was actually um, very clean. It was uh, a lot easier than it could have been. Uh, Boiler Snake, welcome back for 28 months. My buddy Superfly for 33. And Mini B2K for four months. Thank you, friends. Uh, okay, so. Weren't we going to build a All right, chicken uh, thing? The next thing we're going to need for this farm is either Silk Touch Glowstone. Pardon me. Silk Touch Glowstone, if you want to grab that for us, James, because I believe you have the only Silk Touch <gasps> Pick, or we can sure. use jack o' lanterns. I don't know how many uh, no, I can how go many get, pumpkins I, we have, Uno. I can go get self touch. I haven't even been growing pumpkins. Oh, yeah, and that's fine. We need, uh, yeah, we need a block light source for this. I will go get some. Steve Stein, 50 months, welcome back. I like Zombies redstone lamps. Still need glowstone. Zombies attack through corners, apparently. Cool. Yeah, I'm not too worried. It is solving a problem of something that we're, it's like we're not gonna be living there for very long. But I, all right, let's go. And if we simply don't let zombies exist, yeah, we'll just sleep. Glowstone. Um, I'm trying to find an actual list. Here we go. Uh, four. Okay. So this build needs uh, 364 blocks, five stacks plus 44, 122 glass, so one stack plus 58. So I don't know how much glass, how much sand we have on us. Might need to take a quick trip to the desert. Oh, never mind. We've got we've got enough sand. Amazing. Oh, that sand. So yeah, got enough. That. Um, we need 12 signs. 10 villagers? Oh, do we need enough villagers f for them to generate? Hold on. Oh, 
Oh, there's two boxes? One second here. Where's the list of things we need? Um, here, I'll, I'll throw the tutorial we're following into chat. Is the actual number of things in the video? Uh, it's the top comment. Oh, okay. That's a good amount of wheat that we've got now. Alright. Oh, apparently we're fine with two or three. Um, if you just give them food, the, we trick the villagers into thinking it's a village, and they'll they'll multiply naturally to the level we need to start producing iron golems. Okay. So that's kind of cool. Like, now that I'm watching the tutorial with sound. That's a rose. I was going to say, I was thinking they should, but... It's sort of like a combination iron farm breeder. Well, there's a there's a finite amount that'll go into it, which is fine too. Yeah, and I think at this stage, iron golems are one per ten villagers, I guess. I have no idea. I, I, this doesn't seem like one of the the modern treatises of uh, that we're used to when it comes to like here's how the mechanic works and here's how we're manipulating it. This is very much a like. Hey, what's up, gamers? <laughs> I'm making Minecraft content because I'm make everybody's a farm. making it. And you're like, okay, and so, you know, it is what it is there. Um, I'm going to take a very short bio break, if that's okay. Sure. Okay, I'm I will be right back. Collecting resources. Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll log out in case you all need to sleep. Um, eight water? I mean, that's just, yeah. Comparators and repeaters. Um, do we have the stuff for comparators and repeaters? Uh, needs um, comparators is nether crystal. Nether quartz. Nether quartz. Do we have any of that or no? Um, oh crap! I it only got added in one point five, so we've not actually been and explored for it. Okay, uh, we'll be right back. Yeah, I'll go and I'll go and hunt some as well. Uh, but we might have to go relatively far. Um, we haven't really done much exploring, I don't think. Uh, hold on, we need glass. We need 122 glass. We have 30 here, so that's 94. Um, 104. Um, how many more do we need? 104, need 18 more. I think that's right. Let's go. I realize we need to smelt stuff. All right, actually, if you want to go start hunting for quartz. Yep. I'm just going to keep... Uh, I'm just going to basically go one direction until I start seeing quartz. Can you make a trap chest again? 
Um, it's a chest and a tripwire hook, trip isn't it? Tripwire hook? How do you make a tripwire hook? Uh, piece of iron and a block of some of wood and a stick, isn't it? Anybody know how to make a tripwire hook? String involved? I assume string is involved. Uh, we need a hundred and three hundred five stack. Okay, so we're gonna do one, two, three, four, five, and then we'll go just six stacks. So we'll do that. This will be what we're building it out of. It's not pretty, but we don't, we don't care really. Iron sticks, iron ingot stick plank from top to bottom. That's what I feel it was. Uh, you got all the glowstone you needed, didn't we? Yeah. There's a trap chest. Perfect. Thank you, friends. Starlit Ghost. Welcome back. Thank you so much. All right. We got our 12 signs. We've got our 364 blocks. We're smelting glass. We have villagers. We have eight hopper. Water is just water. We have glowstone, redstone, two redstone torches, two comparators, two repeaters. Do we need... We need, um, quartz for both those? Uh, no, repeaters don't need quartz. Repeaters need smooth stone? Yeah, so we might need to get some smooth stone cooking as well. Okay. Uh, or, or stone, as it is currently known. God, Starlight Ghost, that's a long time. Thank you. Basically not cobble. Um, yeah, but not stone. It needs to be smooth stone, right? It's where smooth stone, it's just smelt cobble. Whatever that is. That's stone. Yeah. And then what's smooth the actual stone. recipe? Um, you need three redstone torches. No, two redstone torches for the um, repeater, isn't it? Smooth st uh, stone along the bottom, redstone torch left and right. And then... Ah, and then redstone repeat. Okay, cool. Got it. Uh, and the comparator is similar, but you need three torches. Uh, and then nether quartz in the center torch, top left, right. Yeah, but I don't have quartz, so that will have to wait. How many... How much quartz do we need? Um, what, we need two. We need two pieces of quartz to, oh. get, to get this. Well, I'll bring a. I'll I'll basically mine this little vein out. Let's see. God, I forgot how ugly this was. And then we just need the. Okay, so that's easy peasy. Uh, that can go here. We don't need the sticks anymore. Water buckets. Um. Okay. We'll need one more water bucket. That's easy. Uh, lava bucket. Oh, we need a bucket of lava. Should be easy. There, is there still lava over here? Dang it. Fine Null, welcome back for nine months. Thank you. Ow. Uh, 
I just love ghasts being everywhere. I don't believe you do. No, it, it's true. It's a lie. How do we get a poppy? This thing is asking uh, for a kill poppy. Kill an golem. Yeah. Why does it want a poppy? I don't, oh, shoot. Shoot, 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 shoot. What possible mechanical reason? I don't understand why it's asking for a poppy, so I don't know. I'm just going off of this list. Weren't they roses back then? That's what I'm thinking. Like, that's what these are. I don't think poppies are actually in the game yet. I mean, I'll grab this. I think they just get renamed at some point. I'll just grab that. Ah, there's my... I need that. Red poppies replaced roses. Yeah, because now you have rose bushes, right? And those are those are different. Yep. Hey, what up, friends? Yo. Um, I'm starting to feel kind of terrible. All right. Uh, so I think I'm going to bounce. Do you need uh, a hand at all of anything before I, I take off? No, that's fine. Go feel awesome. better. Sorry for the uh, sorry for the last minute at Bailarino. Yeah, no worries. Yeah, no worries. Take right, care. To Feel better. Accomplish. Bye. <laughs> I know you're back, but I can't see you, and it's freaking me out. <laughs> um, I hate well, it. I'm here. Ah! Okay, I don't need all of this. Wait. There, there we go. Okay. We do this. We do this. We do that. Okay. Look, look at the 1.6 feature. Um, all right. Put that over carpet. here. Oh, yeah, carpet. Okay. And now... Uh, Ober Spawner. Spanner, welcome back for five months. I always forget the Prime sub. Well, I appreciate it. Okay. So are we are we gonna are we gonna attempt to build this thing? I mean it seems like a truly foolish endeavor, so <laughs> probably yeah. It's either that or we go hunt for horses. Yeah, I mean I'm, I'm good to go try and find some horses as well. I think okay, so let's just take a look here. We've got we've got our three hundred and sixty four blocks, we've got is this a hundred and twenty two glass? I think so. Yeah. Uh, just on the two stack? Uh, we've got 12 signs, we've got our villagers, we've got eight hoppers here. Uh, I got water, we don't have, we, that's easy enough to do though. Uh, four glowstone, four redstone dust, four, two redstone torches, two comparators, two repeaters, one chest, one trap chest, an iron ingot. Uh, oh, missing the iron ingot. Don't know why, but. Don't know why we need it, but I'm gonna grab it. Okay, it's like what? Wait, what? yeah, it says nothing here about doors. Wait, <laughs> I feel like this list is incomplete because it doesn't mention you need doors. Sounds like the list included the first Iron Golem death. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, that would make sense as to why there's like a poppy. Yeah, and an iron ingot, maybe? Yeah. But, yeah, why... Nowhere does it say about doors. I assume we need doors. Wouldn't the poppy rose and ingot be hopper filtering? I don't think so. I don't think this has hopper filtering. Yeah, I know, I know doors are key. <laughs> That's why it's just like, wait, hold on. Keys are for doors. Yeah, we need a lot of doors. 
Oh, it's in the comments. 40 wooden doors. That's what I'm looking at. I'm looking at the comments. Oh, yeah, you forgot. The the top comment on the top com The top reply to the co top comment, which is the list of everything you need, is somebody saying, you forgot doors. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so are you making doors? I'll make doors. Uh, I can make doors. No, it's, it's fine. I, I, I can make doors. I just thought maybe okay. that's what you were doing. I didn't want to oh, make Oh, no, more. I was putting away food. Wooden door. Oh, my God, they don't stack. <laughs> What? Chat. They don't stack. Uh, we should probably sleep. To, uh, just in case the villagers... Oh, no. Also, you know, we could, you, you know, know since, since he's not here... You know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hey. Man, this room is so much more spacious. Holy so moly. Much room for activities. So many rooms for activities. Look at this. I can climb up on the walls. I can jump so high. I can get high enough in this room that I can take fall damage. Okay. Well, seriously, doors don't stack? That's wildly frustrating. Uh, well, we could load them into a shulk. Oh, wait. <laughs> How did doors not stack? Okay. Do 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 That's, that's infuriating. Oh, I remember why I wanted lava. Uh, five more doors? Five more doors! Did you get the bucket of lava? Wait, 15 more doors? Oh, you're right, you're right. Sorry, 15 more doors. Yeah, I have a bucket of lava. Okay. God, this is so many doors. Uh oh. It, it, it's, it's not that many doors, really. I'm assuming this just makes. Yeah, okay. Okay, this is six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay. How do you build this thing? The problem with me trying to do... Okay, step... So the problem... Okay. For step one is build ten blocks up into the air. So there's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Step one, build ten blocks... Okay, here's what we're going to do. Um, let's... Let's... Let's figure out where we're going to build this thing. Let me go get an axe here. Did I make five too many doors? Don't worry about it. It's fine, chat. We'll probably need those. Okay. Where's, where's my... Here's my axe. Okay. So here's what I'm thinking. Let's build it. I mean, so... The villagers are right over there. Maybe we should just build it over here. Cut down these trees. And just put it right here. Uno, where are you? I'm in the nether. Oh, okay. I thought lava would be easier to get in the nether. But... Just go down the mineshaft. We have lava. Oh, yeah, there's tons down there. Well, I'm um, we, like, in hell now. We have lava, though. 
I know, but I, I wanted some for, for other reasons. Okay, that's not ominous. There we go, one bucket of lava. Oh, this tree sucks! Oh my god. These oak trees should be illegal. <laughs> Is it a big one? Yeah. They're the most frustrating. And there goes my axe. It's it's the fact that just some usually you get everything and then oh oh no, no, there's just one log in those leaves. Yep. I couldn't see. Let me out. What, what? You suddenly zip through there. So where are you thinking about building this? Uh, oh, zombie. Ah, okay, good. Uh, over. You're just in this farm. It's weird. Uh, right over here. Okay. In this area. Yeah. So if you want to keep clearing the, there's a couple remaining logs in here. Just make sure that this isn't touching. There we go. Please go away. You stupid bitch. Save your life. Kay. My hero. I'm gonna go start getting all of the resources that we need. Moved over here. I think this is a an okay place for this thing. I don't know. I guess we're gonna find out. Yeah, clipping clipping into the ground is because uh, I'm because I'm English. Mm. It's what we do, you know. It's one of them bonuses of being English. Yeah, there's there's a few things that we get. Um, an inexplicable sense that it's coming home and clipping through the uh, <laughs> clipping through the floor. God, this tree really should be illegal. They're just frustrating. Oh, another piece there. Is that it? No, no, there's another piece there. Okay. Sorry, this farm is gonna be great. Look at all those doors. This farm is gonna be like my Frosties. Great. <laughs> Frosties? Yeah. Is that what they're called? You, yeah, do you, do you not call them Frosties? No, they're called Frosted Flakes. Yeah, that's boring. <laughs> the Frosties over here. Kellogg's Frosties. Yeah, Kellogg's Frosted fr Flakes. Frosted Frakes. Frosted Frakes. All right. Uh, that episode of that episode of Next Gen where Riker got cold. You missed the piece. Okay, I think. Oh, you missed a piece. Uh, I wasn't finished. <laughs> Think that's everything? I think that is. 
free apple. Oh, I'm not picking those up. Oh dear. They just fall over and over again. Okay, let's just... Oh yeah, this is what I wanted the lava for. Oh, your chicken thing? Ow, why am I on fire? Huh. sort of fled to the... What I wouldn't give for fr fast tree decay. Come on! Okay. I think we're in a reasonably good shape here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and just get some beds over here. Do you have a bed on you? I do. I'm in it. Sleep. Take this bed. All right, let's build this thing. Or try. Can we build this in an hour? I don't know. Don't know. Let's find out. I doubt it. I'll come and help in a minute, though. Okay, so, step one. Ten blocks up. Let's go right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. block. Now I've already got a collection point set aside, so I'm going to build a little 4x4 four four square around that, making sure we're appropriately centered. Fantastic. And then I need to create it. Okay, so looks like he went uh, let's do this. Uh, Rita, welcome back for 35 months. Uh, all right, you can can you break the blocks that are beneath me there, and then also dig out just the two by two hole uh, that lines up with the uh, with this. I can I can get these two. How deep does this hole need just, to be? Just make it just make it one deep for now. So that should be lined up the same should be okay 10 by 10 platform centered around this to yep. do that i'm just going to extend three blocks on each side okay so then looks like he's going 10 he goes one two three one two three and then i assume just filling those in right like so and then once I fill this all in, you can see this will be a nice big 10 by 10 platform. So okay, so that's easy enough to do.
Oh, I did not. Hmm. Oh, that was stupid. Ow. Alright, so what's what's going on here? Um I don't quite know. Uh Right now, just building a 10 by 10 platform. If you want to grab more of these doors, basically a full inventory of doors, that would be good. Uh, and then we also need, do you have any ladders on you? No. Can you go grab some I can craft ladders? Some, I can grab some ladders. Yeah, Give go me, I've got a load of wood. Let me craft a bunch up. Yeah. Craft some ladders and put it on this thing that I just built up here. On the pole that I just built. Oh, those aren't ladders. Those are fences. <laughs> okay, don't don't craft fences. Don't need those. Filling One this second. in, and we'll check it in a second. Awesome, good job. I'm glad that you can count to ten twice. I the can. We need to do is extend this one block out. S so, fences are just sideways ladders. Three high walls all around. Okay, so now here's um some cobble. If you come off of this, we need to go three high all the way around on the outside. It's a good job I didn't fill my inventory with doors. It's fine. Okay. So now that's done. Found this thing, so we'll just continue to build like this. We'll go back and destroy that block in a second. And I do just want to make a quick iron iron block. Add glowstone around the edges of these three high. Okay. Now, oh, okay. It looks like we don't need to worry about the corners. So I'm gonna knock the corners out. And oh, can you go grab the glowstone that's in the chest down there? Uh, just a sec. I am... Um... Perfect. Just doing this so that we can get out. Are you still full I'm with doors? In. No, I didn't pick up any. Uh, let me go and grab. Here, let's just grab. We should, between the two of us, I think we should be able to grab pretty much everything here, so... Um, yeah, grab some more doors. Um, I can't imagine... Okay, I'm just going to grab the glowstone for now. Do you have a bucket of water on you? I have a bucket of lava. Okay, we'll need a bucket of water probably. Whoopsies. I didn't mean to pick all that crap up. Alright, let's head back up. So, uh, do you need any more blocks while we're down here? Uh, I don't know. I'm just gonna follow this step by step and figure it out so okay glowstone has been placed next walls uh this is so once you're right within range i have of this, as many doors as i can get okay. spawning up here potentially eating your villagers or getting mixed into the filter system uh, so just adding oh, there is a filter into system. these four corners will be more than enough to shut this thing down for hostile mob spawns. Next, please. In step two, we're going to be adding doors, doors galore. We're going to be placing 40 doors, which is going to give us 14 villagers. Now, that's awesome because that means once you get the first two... Okay, doors. It looks like he's placing them... Oh, my God. Uh, he's placing them like this. 
Ugh. Hold on. <laughs> Need to do this. Fill up my... There we go. There we go. This is not easy. Do you have uh, all the doors, or are there more down there? I think there's probably a few left. Okay, I'm gonna go grab them. Oh god, I remember this design. This is not. No, this isn't. We're we're building an iron, or we're trying to build an iron farm. Uh, how that goes, I don't. I, I don't know. We're we're gonna find out. You said you had a um. Bucket of lava? Yeah. Can you throw it down? Uh, if I can escape this door. There we go. Please go away. Ow! Oh my god. Alright, uh, all the doors are in place. There should be a few more, I'm coming up. Oh wait, no there's not. Do we have we have all the doors, don't we? All the doors are in place. Because I made five extra and there's five left. Okay. Uh let's go to bed. Yep. Just gonna quickly kill this ow. Ow. Oh my god. Ow. Stop it! Oh, okay. I didn't think of that. Okay. This is way overkill, but here's a hyper efficient 1617 iron fine by Tango. Yeah, we definitely, uh, we're gonna not, not be doing a hyper efficient thing. Okay. All right, what's next? Two villagers in here. This village is going to team for. At some point, we've got to get the villagers in. We're going to be adding the second spawn platform. This platform needs to be placed on the upper part of all these doors, and it's going to be another ten by ten platform here. So you can see, I've got the door, and so these solid oh, okay. blocks are getting placed on the top half of these doors. So then, just build out your ten by ten platform, and we'll check in in a second. There's another ten by ten platform where the doors are. So, follow me up. How easy is this? Uh, a roof. It's basic... Well, he, he... They just called it a spawning platform, so I don't quite... Oh, okay. Well, that's, that's fine. Yeah. Like this. Eh? You can just go off of this now. And then obviously and then same thing we need to make sure that we leave the uh the two by two gap in the center. Builders wanted to come in. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right. Now what? Uh, one second. Great job on the ten by ten platform. Also, make sure that you did leave that two by two hole in the center perfectly aligned with the bottom one. So that way your iron golems will all collect at the same point. Then for the second half of step three, we need to add the upper walls. So we're going to be placing down some more solid blocks like this. It's going to be just a one high wall one. all around the top ring. One high wall around the top ring. <laughs> How do we get out? <laughs> 
So, yeah. Um, we can probably actually just do it. Wait, how many? How much cobblestone do you have? Fifty. Okay. You want to throw me half of that? So my guess is if we just jump. No. Oh. Okay, that works too. <laughs> I yeah. Oh, it's the weird thing with doors. Uh, the farm. Oh, okay. It looks like the corners are getting done this time, so I think we want to corner up here. This is a uh, yeah, this is an iron farm. Yep. I'm out of okay. uh, coal now. I, I got it. All right. Good. Then, on top of this wall, we need to add one more layer of glass. So this is going to be... One layer of glass around here. I've got the glass, so I can do that. Ooh. <laughs> Definitely thought I was dead there. Oh, I can't... Okay. Eh. <laughs> this is a very strange view. <laughs> okay. That's done. Next. Ugh. The last part of step three. Okay, cool. Step four. Okay, now in step four, we're going to be adding the water. I've got this design set up in such a way that the water is so, so very easy to place. You just drop it in the corner. It couldn't be easier. There's no weird stuff that you've got to do. No extra block placement. I feel there should it's be a lid on put this. The water in maybe the not. Corner. Everything's already spaced out yeah. ever so perfectly for you. So that way, no matter where the iron golem spawns, yeah. you will always okay. get pushed so to the center and push out of the farm. So Then what you need to do is we need to add a villager kind of bucket. Okay. So the f okay. So we need to do... How do I get up there? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> if I open this and fall and take and go to half a heart... <laughs> uh, <laughs> Okay. Seems, seems seems suboptimal. Yeah. Okay, hold on. I'm I'm coming up. How do I get up there? Wait, how did I just try? It? Did I just? Uh, that's the where the door is. I was like, I just opened the door. Okay. Okay. This is fine because <laughs> now I'm in here. Okay. Here's what I'm going to do. Uh, I'm going to create an infinite water source here. Okay. So it looks very wet in there now. Yeah. And then I'm going to go like this. Break all this. Okay, so that's perfect. So presumably the iron golem's gonna spawn down there. And up there, I think. I think it can spawn in either platform, is the idea. Oh my god. Okay. So there's that. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna fall. Okay. Did you just fall down? Yeah, I jumped. Falling implies that I didn't mean to. Is there a problem with the uh, the stream all? Okay, I'm just gonna pull up here and do the exact same thing up here. Yep. 
Water. 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 And water. And then we're gonna go like this. All right. Okay. Oh, oh, okay, good. Okay, we're good. And then we're gonna come down here. Okay. Uh, can you break those? Can you break that? Actually, I guess leave it for now, just in case we need to get back up there. Okay. We do need to get like villagers in something. Villagers to stand in, presumably. So I'm just pick any side. It doesn't matter. Another thing about this simplistic farm is you only need. I don't know where. Shoot! 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 Ah! Go away! Oh my god. Do I have? villager pouch which is a lot better than needing like two or three or four or eight or sixteen uh, so what I'm doing here is I've just made a four uh, four by one area here uh, where the villagers would be able to stand now in in a let's play world or in a okay. vanilla world you're not gonna so let's because the villagers are facing that way we're gonna put the this villager box here um do you have any random building blocks I could borrow here? Nope, I'm out. Okay. I can go and grab some cobble, though. Yeah, that'd be great. Or do you want something, like, not cobble? Uh, no, cobble's fine. So what we're going to do is we're going to jump up here. Am I... You're all watching still, right? <laughs> I assume they are. Sorry, just people were talking about like a really long delay and I was confused and chat was very slow, so I was I was just like, Am I still streaming to people? But yeah, we're good. Okay. We're good. Uh, Thank you. We sleep Canoe we... Crasher, yeah. Canoe Crasher, thanks for the uh fifty month resub, appreciate it. Alright. Uh so you have some uh so I'll tell you right now, if you want to go and start... So here's here's what we're going to do. We're going to be taking those villagers that we've obviously trapped, and the box is going to be up here. So if you want to start working a way to, to get them from here to up there, um, that would be good. And then, so it looks like... Okay, so it looks like he went... Like this. Where is the? Is that the floor of the? Um... Yes. Right. Okay. So I need to be up there. So that. Yeah. We're gonna drop them in there. So it need to be a little higher here. I think. Okay, let me just while you're doing that. Villager spawn eggs, so you're likely going to need to set up some sort of rail system, minecart system to be able to minecart these villagers. And and you can see that all it takes is two villagers, okay. so you're not uh, even gonna have to take a whole I need lot some out of rails. Village, uh, before uh, they'll start breeding, and then they'll breed up to the required amount needed for iron golems to farm. So there's nothing left for you to do regarding villagers. And presumably they're all still in minecarts. Step five, we're going to be mm -hmm. adding the iron golem collection, kill, and loot area. The first thing that we're going to need to do is select the side we want to act as the front. I'm going to choose this one here, then spin underneath it here, and then center yourself underneath this two by two hole. Select the back two front or the back two blocks here, and then you're going to place down immediately under those two, uh, two solid blocks. Then under here, we're going to. Okay. So while Uno is working on that, 
So Uno's job is to get villagers into that box. I believe in Uno. Can somebody tell me that's not a bad idea? You can't place rails on glass. That's fine. Just break one. Yep. I was going to break one. So it looks like two. Okay, so he's got nope, that nope, here. Nope, 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 nope. Start to build the an item filter. I've also made a tutorial. Okay, we're just gonna build whatever this is and hope it works. No, 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 no. Well, specifically for the iron filter. Stop dying, you cowards. For an item filter, so I'm not going to go over it in extreme detail. That's good, because I don't want extreme detail. The day, if you want to learn more about item filters. Uh, I'll include a link of the in the description of this video. Um, so the big thing, if you're just tuning in. Why would you just be tuning in? <laughs> it's, a, it's an eight and a half minute video. And at the six and a half minute mark, he's like, if you've just been tuning in. Or item filters for the first time is make sure that the tails of these top two hoppers are facing. Not downwards. That's. Yeah, if you've just tuned in, where have you been? Yeah. It's the most important thing. And then the tails of these two bottom ones make sure. Also, there are only two villages. I thought we. Can drop a chest Did we only do two? Chat, or a trap chest. Pardon me? Did we only do two villages? I mean, bring. We have three here. The other one is on the other side of that hill, I think. Oh, right. Okay. Yes, that they'll funnel into. Then we need to actually set up the filter. So in the top right, that's left two in. hopper here, we're going to add signs and then a single. Oh, right. Okay. I see where the other one is. Iron ingot. And it's like these baby right <laughs> coming up come and have a look at this signs again exactly like so by by the nether portal the baby zombies polished, are just staring at the, the couple blocks way, all the iron will end up in this chest and all the popped roses will end up in this one then what we need to do is center ourselves hey back hey zombies that two by two pole and we need to create a little hopper array a little circular hopper array so you can see how each hopper here that I've just placed is funneling into the next Guys. hopper. So it's just going to create each hopper here that I've, the iron will end up in this chest and all the poppy roses will end up in this one. Then what we need to do is center ourselves back underneath that. All two right, by how two do we hole. get you out we there? To create a little hopper array, a little it's circular a few rails that I've array. got. So you can see how each hopper here that I've just placed is funneling into the next hopper. So it's just going to create like an infinite loop of items moving in between these four hoppers. Then we need to create kind of like a tunnel here, a tube that our iron golems will fall down. From there we... Uh, wait, hold on. Underneath that create a little hopper array, a little circular That's hopper array. That's facing into so that one, that one's facing into that one, and then that one's facing into this one. Cat. Here that I've just a tunnel here, a tube that our iron golems will fall down. 
From there, we need to open the tube up, place down some signs, four signs to be exact, just like so. Uh, this is going to be what's holding up the lava, the lava being what kills the iron golem. Yeah, okay. So... I can just craft some. It's fine. You do get a good amount for six iron, at least. And I think. Yeah, signs here. And then this is where the lava goes. And then we close this out. Okay. Okay. Just getting the last villager. Yep. Somehow. Uh, I think I broke. Yeah, I broke the. Uh... There we go. There's three villages in there. So break them out of the carts. I'm just gonna try that. This is very difficult without proper bounding boxes. Oh, they, they'll breed anyway, apparently. Yep. Even in the carts? Yep. Oh, well, let's get them out of the carts just in case. Uh, that's not good. What? Is he in the box? Oh, he might be... I don't know. No, well, let's try to get the other two. Oh, he's just... That one's okay. Nope, nope. nope. Here, let's get them all... Here, let's actually... Stop, don't do that one yet. Oh, that one's back now. There we go. Oh, no. Come on. There we go. Okay. Yeah, break the other All right. one. All right. And watch out. Yeah, this is... There we go. Yeah, that's fine. All right. I'm going to break this. Give them the roof that they so rightly deserve. Um, do you have any more glass on you? No, I never had any. Uh, okay. Okay. I should have three more. Give me a second here. Let's go to bed real quick. God, who thought we couldn't do this? Do we need to get there? There we go. Oh, there's still that's still so broken. Okay, give me a second here. I'm just gonna go grab some more glass. So I can finish that up. Uh, 
by pick. Time to file a bug report. Seems like a reasonable thing. Yeah, your villages in 1.6 are uh, a little funky. Yeah, please address. <laughs> could you could you fix them? Uh, okay, so hold on. From there, I just want to make one last note that you cannot build any blocks on any side uh, above these five blocks here. So on any side like so, what this will do Tune is it'll next prevent week these find doors out. from counting at... Okay, so... Okay. So that's good to know. Okay, we got that. I suspect this iron farm will break in a later update. Almost certainly. Um... And that's fine, as long as we can get some iron in the meantime. Okay, so here's what we need to do. I have the last couple blocks here, and then we need to break down this structure that... Um... Do you not need to give them food? Nope. Didn't say so. All right, let's go. Oh, they're going to they're gonna shove themselves into the wall and suffocate, I'm sure. I, I mean, I think it's all just grab... Here, just let's go. Because this is, I think, stopping this. Okay. We have built this exactly as the video said to. Now where's our iron? Need to give. We need, need to, to get, get ten. I. So, it sounds like it should work like this, and also these already produced a baby. Maybe they already had wheat. All right. Well, I'll here. I'm gonna go get a bunch of wheat here. Do they need or do they wait? Need bread. They need bread. Alright. If I give you seeds, can you, uh, here, I'll trade you. Um. Yeah. Here's some seeds. I'm gonna go make a bunch of bread steal the bread that we had already. Okay, that's a stack of bread. Let's go give them that and see what happens. The oh. miracle of nature. See, they're they're breeding right now. They are actively breeding.
So maybe we just need to, you know, give them time. That's my hell. Yeah, like they're not even. I don't. Do villagers do the bread thing in 1.6? I don't think that is that a thing. Like they're not picking it up. But we've we have another villager. Maybe they. Maybe they don't need food. Maybe they just. Maybe they just breed because of doors. You know, Lord getting all, no, all, f yeah, all frisky all, for all, doors. I mean, Lord knows that's how that's how I work. I this is pro. I think this is just pre-food. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, I gave them bread. We'll see if they pick it up. Um. Hopefully, we get just more villagers. Like, it should work. It just shouldn't be, like, super efficient, I get, or as efficient as it could be until there's more. Do they need more room? I don't know. This is... I'm, I'm just following the video. Yeah. The video... I think villagers take... It's it's one per ten villagers, I think. So, okay. So here's an update that's posted in this video's description. Update. Villager breeding has been changed in 1.8. Villagers no longer automatically breed, meaning that dropping just two villagers into this design will not work. You will need to manually move 10 into the design. But this is 1.6. And we, we can obviously see that they are breeding. So I think we're fine. And yeah, like it should, it, it's probably just not going to work like instantaneously. So like we got to give it a bit of time here. Um, I just don't know how much. Well, we've got one, two, three, four, five in there. One of them's in there in his little lab coat. Yeah. Yeah, he like. Might be a Librarian? I assume there is cooldowns, so I assume it will take a, a little bit more time to get more. I my assumption is that ten fit in here just fine because again, this is the design. Um it is also not just some rando YouTube video with like eight thousand views. This has three million views. So like people have been using it and, and, and stuff like that. So I'm guessing this is all just visual glitching and bugging. Which shocker, I know. <laughs> but this is this is built how it should be. I think maybe I'm gonna cut down this tree just in case. Shouldn't matter. It shouldn't matter, but it's an easy fix or it's an easy thing to do real quick here. I appreciate how much of uh, how much how much cobblestone is used in this construction. I mean, that's just classic Minecraft right there, right? Yeah. Based on the wiki, it sounds like they will just infinitely breed in 1.6. There we go. Perfect. Can't see a problem with that at all. Yeah. How long does it take for them to grow up? So glitchy. 
I do love that it's just such old school Minecraft to have these big giant farms just built like co just the big cobblestone thing over there, just that cobblestone <laughs> here. I just, I love it. It looks so good. Just, just a massive cobble box. Yeah. What's in there? Where uh, my house? But I mean, we we have built this thing to exactly the video, so there's really not much we can do at this point except for just kind of wait and uh, and see what Oop. happens. Do villagers drop meat? No, villagers don't drop anything when they're killed. Not even emeralds. Oh, we're getting another villager. Uh, we have a bunch of subs here, and I missed. Wizard Zed, welcome back for 102 mu 112 munch. Fisher, welcome back for 76. Canoe Crasher, welcome back for 50. Uh, Alchemist Merlin, welcome back for 92. And uh, Mordor Shatten, welcome back for 6. Thank you, friends. Wait, did we get another one? I don't think so. We didn't. I don't see one. No, we've still got three and two babies. Yeah. But I did just see hearts, so... 20 minutes to grow? All right. So the problem is is that, yeah, I don't really want to uh, walk away. I think there are six in there. Are there? I'm just looking at the E on F3. Oh. Uh, oh, uh, maybe? No, there's only five. Yeah, there's only five. Maybe it was catching you or something. version all right there we go okay oh some more there we go more hearts, hearts more hearts come on why would you do it in front of the children it does feel like there should be more room but i don't like i'm not gonna change the design like i almost feel like you, you want a two by one but it's not like you don't... It's not the weird thing where you have to have multiple of these boxes or anything. No, it? no. It's just the one. Like, I I, I remember building them with mox, multiple boxes around, but this is supposed to work. Maybe, maybe they can't get to each other? I don't know. Maybe, like, the one on the left and the one on the right... This design I'll by call Nims, left and right. yeah, by Nims TV, formerly, formerly Nims Gaming, is possibly not the most efficient design, but is still very reliable. It spawns one golem every two minutes, as of 13w16a, via the 2013 wiki. So is that? I'm curious if that's one golem every two minutes with ten villagers. I assume that would be with, with, yeah, the ten villagers that you'd want. Oh, see more hearts. Come on. More babos, please. You need to start having babies. In the words of Laura Roslin. <laughs> hmm, I don't know. I mean, if the villagers spawned in the cobblestone, um, that's probably a problem for the villagers because they'll go in the water and then fall in the fire. They shouldn't. Yeah, again, I, I, I'm not questioning the design. Like, it, it, it's clearly a working design. Um, but again, we've been, you know, we finished it 10 or 15 minutes ago. So, you know, you have to give it time to, to get all up and running. I just don't know what the rules for um, spawning a golem are in this version. Uh, there needs to be at least 10 villagers, basically. At this point. Uh, 
No, you don't need monsters. This isn't the yeah. This isn't using the the sort of the fear based mechanic uh, that is significantly more popular now. I I don't even think the fear me mechanic exists. In oh this no, group. they don't panic yet. Yeah, I don't think they. That's, that's just not a thing. It's basically just it will spawn an iron golem because it. We've basically tricked the game into thinking that this is a village. That's what all the doors are for. I would just like to see one of the babies grow up. Yeah, there's no there's no like gossip or anything like that. Alright, well, I'm, uh, I realize that we have only about half an hour left, but, um, I'm going to take a quick break here, uh, and then when we come back, I think we're just going to kind of hang out and see how this goes. I don't want to, like, the other thing that we could do, obviously, is go look for horses, but the problem with doing that is then we're not loading these chunks and I'd really like to see if this is going to work. So, um, what time of day is it? All right, we, we, we got some time here. Uh, I'm just going to go take a quick break and uh, I'll be right back. So don't go anywhere. What up? We're back. We're six villages. Yeah. We have six villagers. One grew up. And now we're up to six. All right, let's go to bed. Like, I wonder what trades they've got. <laughs> um. Is there no MOC next week? No, there's MOC next week. Why? Why wouldn't there be? Why Why do you think there's no MOC next week? I did just see a message that there will be no talking sim today, unfortunately. Um, and I will update the schedule in a moment. I didn't see it on the schedule graphic. That's because that schedule graphic would only go up until tomorrow, next week's crossing the stream. That would be the last, crossing the stream next week would probably be the last one that it would show on that schedule. Based on how that thing works. Need more of you. All right. Well, now it's uh, Villager Watch 2022. <laughs> Villager Watch. Bill Aldi when you need him. The uh, the uh, the Villager Watch 2022 AMA. Go for it, chat. What would you like to know? Yeah, there is MOC. Uh, I don't think we're actually maybe go mining. I don't want to. I think that would unload the chunks though. Uh, depends how far, which direction we mine. Yeah, that's the problem. It's fine. We can just hang out and chat. Yeah, Bas I mean, Basquala asked, tacos or burritos? Uh, tacos. Oh, uh, you sound like a good burrito. Mm. Oh, wow. Well. Uh, should you fish for saddles? I guess we could, but then I'd have to do stuff. Um... Why is the lava source block not symmetrically placed? Because it doesn't need to be. It's just one block. It's just it's just one block. Like I could do, you could do four to make it nice and clean looking, but I just had the one because that's all it said that we had. The other option would be put it in the corners. Goodbye, villager. Yeah. But unfortunately, you can only place lava in one block. You can't place it in a uh, quarter in four. 
hard shell or soft shell? Uh, soft shell. Or maybe like a, a nice shell, print. A hard shell taco is is difficult. Yeah, I'm I'm not a big fan of hard shell tacos. Like they're fine, but I definitely prefer the the soft shell. Um, also, soft shell burrito. Never go for the hard shell burrito. Yeah, hard shell burritos are just the worst. Never, never, never do that. Never do that. Like, hey, there's, there's like a third baby now. Hey. There's a third baby. This is this is going well. Um, why is one of the villagers boomeranging towards us out of the glass? Because Minecraft is a very broken game. Corn or flour tortilla? Corn. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't think I have a preference. You're really I mean, making me want to go buy one of thing. these. Yeah, that's fair. Coke or Pepsi? Um, Coke. I have a soda stream, so Pepsi. Coke, and it's not even close. What? <laughs> well, we talked about tacos, so you summoned Ashley. <laughs> no, we had tacos last night. No, it was yesterday afternoon. Whatever. <laughs> no, more, enough. no more tacos. All right. Poutine tacos? Poutine tacos. I don't know what that is, but I want it. <laughs> it's mostly just put poutine in the taco shell. Mm. You can have two taco meals in a row. It's true. Maybe I'll go up for tacos. A Dublo taco. <laughs> Oh, and then tomorrow we'll be boxing taco. Oh, are we up to five adults now? Yeah. Uh, yeah. The uh, the guy in the lab crow. Yeah, the lab crow grown, grown up. up. Okay. Okay. This is working. Here's a question: Do they all need to be grown up to work, or do we just need ten villagers? Um, I imagine we just need 10 villages. I would assume so, but I don't know. And we've got, what, seven? Yeah, we're getting there. We're getting there. Again, my assumption would be it would start working. It just wouldn't work well, but I don't know. According to the poutine combat, you have to have poutine after MSC. I haven't had poutine for a while. I think Desert Bus? Yeah, Desert Bus was the last time I had poutine, which I guess wasn't that long ago, to be fair. Have you ever gone to the Christmas lights thing at Butchart? I have. I haven't gone this year. Ashley actually just went on Sunday night. Um, it's very nice. Yeah, it's really pretty. Yeah, I've done it a few times over the years. I did it most recently in 2019 is the last time I went to that thing. Um, and these are just Christmas lights? Yeah, so the Butchart Gardens, um, obviously very famous uh, uh, tourist and just sort of attraction here on the island. Um, mm -hmm. It's like 20 minutes, 15, 20 minutes out of town. Um, and every Christmas, they just completely deck out the place in lights like we're talking like millions of lights across the whole uh the whole park um oh, cool. and it's it's gorgeous it looks super cool um always super fun to go to um and yeah yeah ashley was there like four o'clock in the afternoon on sunday she went with a couple friends I would definitely recommend it if you're uh, in town. Even if just Butcher Gardens at any point of the year is definitely worth going to if you're uh, if you're coming to Victoria. I was in I was in town um, Friday and they've um, got like a load of lights up on the cathedral here, but it's like a light show, like projecting like images and baubles and things on it and all changes and there's music and stuff to it. 
Mm. Up against the cathedral. That's neat. That was pretty neat. Is that three babies in there? Uh, I don't know. Ow. I only see two. I think we're still at see? seven, unfortunately. I think we're still at the seven. I assume we haven't had, had anything actually show up yet. No, I think that might be eight. I think it's eight. Looking at, looking at F3. No, yeah, okay. Could be eight. I see eight as well. Oh, some more hearts. Let's go. Let's freaking go. Yeah, right. there's eight in there. Where were some of my other questions here? That taco Too question old. kind of took over. <laughs> <laughs> How are you going to jump scare surge this time? That was um, Beacon Hill Park. Uh, but I'm sure that if Surge and I... Honestly, don't really have time, unfortunately. I was just thinking, uh, Butch Art, uh, uh, a Loading Ready Live, um, we go to Butch Art would be a good one for... Uh, Christmas, but I think we're more or less... I think we've already sort of decided on that episode, so... Never mind. Do you have dinner before or after the stream? Uh, I have it after. What are you having for dinner usually, tonight? Uh, I usually do... We usually do takeout on a Tuesday. Mm. Uh, so I've got burgers on order. Hell yeah. Burgers and loaded fries. Do it as a crossing the streams like that ice cream stream y'all did. I don't know what cell coverage is out is like out there. Um, the only reason that I we probably wouldn't is that um, that's a lot of people out there, um, and none of us are like w super wild about um, just broadcasting people uh, without their permission like it's one thing if it's just like you know a handful of people down by the water and we're walking past it um but this would be a lot of people uh and yes as tq points out also a lot of kids so um we probably uh wouldn't do that it, it would be f uh, trust me i would love to um like if there was a, a chance for us to get out there like that would be amazing um it also would be expensive you're you're not wrong you're not wrong. Come on, I just want one golem. That's all I want before the end of the stream. Bedtime. Yeah. Oh, more hearts. Let's go. Oh, did we get another one? No, I still got eight. Yo, Godeki, welcome back for 101 months. Ooh, it was time for button pressing 100, 101 class. Heck yeah, you aced it. A plus. Hear me out, do an iron stomach challenge again on Loading Ready Live or as an edited video. No, thank you. I mean, we do. We, stomach. we do <laughs> weird, gross, eaty bits on on live still. Like we did the 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 sandwich thing not too long ago. It was fairly tame, but it could have been worse. So, like, we still do that stuff for live. Yeah, the, the sandwich bit was a lot of fun. Love to do more stuff like that. I don't want to do that for various reasons. A, I don't really like eating on camera. Uh, not a fan. Uh, and also, I just, my stomach is just, you know, I have the stomach of a 39-year-old man and not a 23-year-old <laughs> kid anymore. And, like, I, you know, even for comedy's sake, I'm sort of not generally interested in putting myself in, um, in uh, distress in the stomachal area. 
but others are, so that's great. <laughs> Gast gastro intense in intestinal distress. Mm, yeah. I prefer stomachal area. Yeah, acid ref reflex sure is a thing. Uh, so yeah, a reminder, um, I did just say this, um, I, there was no, uh, talking sim this afternoon, uh, so nothing coming up directly after this, um, if I didn't have stuff to do, I'd probably just do a bonus stream, but I unfortunately have a few things that I need to do this afternoon, so, uh, no stream after this, but, uh, Let's Nope is still, as far as I know, uh, happening at 5 p.m., so be sure to tune into that. Uh, we also mentioned uh, in a few places, including it's on the schedule, um, although it's a few weeks out, so you probably wouldn't have seen it yet if that's the only place you check. But we also mentioned in Discord and in on Twitter as well. Um, with December, it means that we've got a couple streams coming up that are sort of December classics. Uh, in a few weeks, uh, on the 17th at 3 p.m. Pacific is a Cameron and Ian Christmas. Uh, so that's, uh, that's in its, god, I think it's probably its seventh or eighth year, maybe? <laughs> it's been going for a while. So that's happening, uh, in a few weeks, and then on Boxing Day, which I know that, I know most people watching don't celebrate, but hey, we do. Um, that is happening on the 26th. Joe Kim! Hey, buddy. Yeah, you remember this design? This is a bit simplified. It's only got the one villager pod, um, as opposed to like the four that I think later ones ended up having. Uh, but this is the this is just what we this is the instructions that we followed. So hopefully it's going to work once we get up to ten villagers. Excellent throws. Look at there this, we go. Perfect. Look at this egg master. It's, uh, it's a lot of practice. We're still only at eight. Come on. Get to ten. Breed faster, damn it. Uh, so yeah, Boxing Day stream on the 26th, starting at 11 a.m. Pacific. I feel like Mojang didn't know what to do and kept changing villager rules every major patch. Yeah. They stay like this until 1.8. At 1.8, they stop breeding indefinitely. Oh, hearts. Hearts. At this rate, it would have been faster to go grab the other villagers. Uh, maybe. There's only one more. I think there was only... Really... Yeah, I don't think there was many more at the uh, at the village. There, there are some more at the village, um, but those were four that uh, like, just happened to be in that house. Right. I was like, I'm not going to try and write them up anymore. There's four here. Yeah, that's fair. The game will... Yeah, that's right. This Thursday, um, we're going to be uh, co-streaming the uh, video game trailer awards. Uh, I mean, sorry, video game awards. Awards. They're giving away awards for video games and not just three hours of trailers. The game awards. The, the game trailers, dot, 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 awards. with some awards. So anyways, that's going to be Thursday night. That's with um, the Chill Point crew. So, uh, Beach, Paul, and Heather. Is it Thursday or is it Friday? Thursday. Oh, right. Okay. That's why I think it's Friday because it's at... Um, it's at 4.30 p.m. 4.30, so, so yeah. half midnight. Yeah. Yeah. You can win stream decks on that, I think, as well. Oh, boy. Not on your stream. Come on. But I think they're giving away 180 or something. That's a lot of stream decks. Yeah, it's like one for every minute or something. Huh. Come on. A stream deck a minute? Which stream deck? Is Steam it the new deck. one? Oh, Steam, Steam deck. deck. Sorry. Steam deck. Oh, God. Valve, you're the worst for choosing to cho to name your thing the Steam Deck, by the way. Uh, is that baby like... Oh, 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 those are lots of hearts. Let's go. Let's go. 
Let's go. Oh, we're at horses. nine. We're at nine. Wait. They're still, they're still hearting. Yeah, it's also the fact that there's a Steam Deck dock. You have to watch the stream through Steam.tv, and you have to register for it, and you have to have purchased something from Steam within the past year. I mean, is there a, like a money? Hey, don't stop it. <laughs> We're at 10. It says 10. It says there's 10. Mine says 8. Really? My E says 10. Look away and then look back. I got 11. I got 7, 7, 7. I got 10 when I look up here. Oh, back to 9. Crap. Oh, 8. Wait, hold on. Is that what that... I don't know how this E works. I think it's entities. Pretty sure it's entities that you can see. Because, like, when I look at the cows, there's, like, 18. When I look at the chickens, there's, like, 55. And then when I look at the villages, there's, like, 8. Yeah, let me try just going like this, maybe. Oh, yeah, okay, I have 8 still. Come on. <laughs> just get to 10! Stay a little late, I mean, it's but not, not much, so I need you to hurry up. It's not like a watched villager never breeds, is it? Yeah. No, it's definitely not. I remember spending like a week on the Iron Phoenix and then it got patched out. Yeah, I remember that. Man, the Iron Phoenix, that thing was that thing was absurd. I mean I wouldn't say no to a free stream. Steam Deck. Steam Deck. I mean, I'd also take a free Steam Deck. Stream Deck, but I have one, so I don't really need one. Uh, but yeah. The Steam yeah, Deck Steam is Deck be great. The Steam Deck is pretty cool. I, I definitely don't I definitely would consider it maybe when it, the second gen comes out, but mm. it's pretty neat and it is just like aggressively well priced for what it is, which is pretty impressive. Yeah. Uh, and that that's probably what they what they're aiming for is just to get that saturation. mm Mhm. Uh, Booster 6, welcome back for 79 months. Can you mod your Steam Deck to work as a Stream Deck? Mm. I, yeah, I also take a free Steam Deck. I mean, I take a free. Can you please, for the love of God, just produce a few more children? You keep you, you keep hearting goodbye. Come on. It does feel like it's just too cramped in there, but oh, 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 oh. Oh, there's a lot of hearts going That's on. That's a lot of hearts. Come on! Let's Just to get together! Let's go to bed. Dang it! Are we are we down another baby again? Have they have they grown up? I think they grew up, yeah. I think there's only one baby now. Come on. <laughs> Come on. We don't ask for much. Uh, 
send Uno to get the last villager and see what happens first. Unfortunately, it is one o'clock, so I don't want to get like super into new stuff here. I just want. Yeah. I just want. I don't mind staying a little. You you can take off whenever you need to with dinner on your way. So, um, I'm gonna hang out just a little bit longer and see if we can get this here. Yeah, my food's in fact just got here, so. All right. I'm gonna call it there. All right. Thanks for hanging out. I'll see you uh, next week. I'll catch you later. Bye. All right. This is it. We're going to give them nine minutes. I'm going to give them until 1.10, and then I have to get going. So, uh, yeah. We're just going to keep hanging out. Wasn't this patch where the villager farm is just a thousand doors in a pit? I mean, probably. I mean, this has worked incredibly well. Like, in less than, like... 45 minutes probably we've gone from three villagers to eight like it just works and I do feel like maybe if they had some more room but I don't like I just what I want to do is just bring the wall out one to give them two blocks to move around more freely but I think that might screw with the 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 farm right like there's a reason that it's built this way and I am not smart enough to to improve upon it by making one change that would just probably screw the whole thing up. Because, like, part of me wonders if the reason why it's they're having problems is because they're running into each other and the two villagers that have triggered to breed can't get to each other, but I don't think that's, like, a huge problem. We got some more hearts there. Like it's working. There's a, um, I should go grab that, actually. The reason there is a fire there is because there is a single source of lava. Which I can grab. Oh no, you're all on fire. Oh no. We are still waiting for the iron, yeah. We're waiting for there to be 10 villagers up there. And they're taking their sweet freaking time. Could put a torch in there? Sure, let's go torch up that cave a little bit. Oh god. Oh what? Are you freaking kidding me? Oh hey, look at that. A saddle. We already have an XP farm. That's kind of wild that there's just another... That's even close. That's so much close. This is just like right under our base. That's ridiculous. How are we doing? Oh, oh, okay. That's his nine. 
That's his nine. Come on, give us one more. No, it's been at eight for a while. It was at nine because I think I had, see like if I do this, it's picking up something else in the area. So it goes up to 10. But if I just do that, we're now, we're now cleanly at nine, I think. So we just need one more. I mean, yeah, let's, uh, let's just, we should be able to go over here and clean up our inventory. Actually, let's, yeah, let's, uh, let's do this. Let's not break. The other XP farm is, yeah, too far away, I think. Saddle, keep that. This can all go away. I don't know where we... Yeah, this rail can just go here. All right. All right, still not going to look at it. Let's just grab this... This stuff away. I like our little area here that we've built for ourselves, though. It's it looks good. Break this chest as well. snow is very festive. It's funny because it's only, it's never going to go away now. We're like, we're always going to have snow in our base, I think. It's kind of funny. We've doomed ourselves to snow for the rest of eternity. Okay, that says 10. That says 10. Okay. So this thing should theoretically work. Unless, of course, the villagers all need to be full-grown adults, in which case, it's not. <laughs> yeah! Yo, I want to point out that happened at exactly 110, which is exactly when I said I'd hang out till.
heck? Yes! God, I love it when things just work. Oh, hell yeah. All right. Whew. All right, friends. We did it! We freaking did it. So, I think... Um, I'll definitely be AFKing here a little bit over the course of next week so that next week when we come on, um, we have a good amount of iron and we can do a proper, well, uh, probably not. We still need to get really good tools to be able to do the proper, like, um, like efficiency five haste to like insta mining session. But Hey, we have a good source of iron now and we have a good source of XP. This is feeling good. I'm really liking this playthrough. I think this is fun. Um, like, nothing will ever get too huge. We're never going to build anything that's just, like, completely absurd. Uh, but, yeah. This, uh, this worked exactly how it was supposed to. So now, theoretically, every two minutes, we should get a new uh, Iron Golem. So I'm actually kind of curious to just give it just a minute here to see if we get another one. If you're gonna AFK, it might be worth converting that closer spawner. E but I'll be properly AFKing, and you can't AFK a XP farm. I have to kill them, right? So that's probably not gonna happen. Ooh. Are we gonna get another one? It, it worked. It worked once. And it's supposed to get us one every two-ish minutes. Should prop it, pop in pretty soon. Ooh. It's not, and that's worrying me. I mean, we know it works. As soon as the villagers go, hey, we should have a golem here somewhere. It would be nice, I guess, if it was like consistent because it's definitely been over three minutes now. Contingent Cat, welcome back for 64 months. A full stack of months. Thank you. Can we check to make sure there's no golem stuck inside? Yeah, I don't think there's any way for a golem to get stuck in this thing, though. Yeah, we're fine. I feel like if these things are going to infinitely breed, that might be a problem. Alright, it's been now four minutes. And I don't see another golem. Hmm. Alright, well, uh, I have to get it going, so I'm going to call it there. Um, I will AFK for a bit, though. Um, I'm trying to think of a good place to AFK, actually. I guess I could probably just come down here and like just dig a little uh Oopsies, shoot, that just broke that. Nope, other way. Okay, we're good. Could just AFK right here. <gasps> Got it. 
Cool. All right, it's working. Great. So I'm going to AFK here for a bit and see how this goes. I'm going to AFK here for... I mean, I'll AFK here for as long as I can. And uh, we'll see how we do. Uh, thanks, everybody, for hanging out today. Do appreciate it. Of course, thanks to Uno and Serge for hanging out, as always. We'll be back next week with, ideally, 1.7.10 which is a very big update, so that will be a whole lot of stuff, and ideally we'll have a whole lot of iron next week as well. Uh, so thanks for doing that. Uh, just a reminder, there is no talking sim today. In fact, I'm going to delete it from the schedule right now. There we go. Uh, but they will be back next week. Cam just had something come up, and Corey didn't feel like running it solo today, so... Um, they'll be back next week with, I believe, Heavenly Bodies, which is what they were going to play today. So be sure to tune in next week for that. But in the meantime, uh, Adam and Ben will be live at 5 p.m. with more Signalis on Let's Nope. Uh, and then a whole bunch of other stuff coming up for the rest of the week. Check out loadingreadyrun.com slash live uh, to see what is coming up. Uh, in the meantime, uh, with your afternoon, I don't know, go check out some of our links. We got YouTube channels, we got Discords, we got Patreons, we got Twitters and Instagrams and, and all that jazz. So uh, hit up the links uh, in here. Yes, in the meantime, we pray for a Tarkov wipe. Joe Kim is not wrong. Uh, be sure to hit up all those things. Discord.gg slash LRR, by the way. Um, the mods have been working really hard at getting a, uh, a forum-like channel set up there that pastes every video that goes up on any one of our YouTube channels. And it's kind of like the old forum system where every video has its own post and you can have discussions on it. And it's awesome. So if you're not in the Discord or if you haven't been in the Discord for a while, or if you haven't seen this new part of the Discord, uh, it's like amazing. I love it. It's great. Um, go check it out. Uh, Discord.gg slash LRR. That'll get you the instant invite. Um, and, uh, you can go from there. Uh, alright, friends. Thanks for hanging out. Y'all are awesome. And, uh, I'll see y'all later. Bye, everybody.